This was my first time in the Jeff experience. <laughs> Loved how he just got us all engaged and interacting. It was great. I want to be with the toy people! Yes! I hit you a little bit of this, TJ! Hit it through! Got it, yes! Robert, don't look up, sir. Don't look up. He caught my attention, and he kept it going and never really lost my attention. He was hilarious. He made great jokes. And then his inspirational stuff really made me happy. I love Jeff's message. And th those little things where a little story, a little activity, a little thing that happens can change somebody's life for the better. And that's what we do in the toy industry every single day. When I got my show in Las Vegas, I achieved my goal, but uh, I hadn't yet found my why. And I experienced this crazy shift in perspective because this, I've been I've been searching for this, I've been striving for this goal for you know my whole life and then, then I was there, I became a Las Vegas headliner. I realized, man, that's only the beginning. This ending point that I was reached for now is just the beginning because now I have a platform. Now I have influence, right? What was I gonna do with that platform? What was I gonna do with that influence? I ask all of you the same question. As business owners, as leaders in your field, you have a platform, you have power, you have influence. Well, what are you doing with it? How are you maximizing it? I think this was a brilliant start because it is gonna have everybody opening up and talking and thinking about their why. I can't really know what drives you. I can make some educated guesses based on the type of people you are and the type of industry that this is, um, but no one knows better than the people seated with you at your tables about what you've been through in the past two plus years, the challenges. And I want you to just get back in touch with why you do the work you do. My personal philosophy we live our lives with love, kindness, and grace. The world's a better place. Wow. Jeff does a really good job of everybody coming together and connecting. Remembering why we started what we were doing is pretty incredible, and bringing that forefront at a show like this is amazing. Jeff Sabiligo's keynote really spurred a bunch of great conversations. I knew everybody at the table, and, but there's one gal I did not know her origin story, and it was really a fascinating story. I've known her for 29 years, just didn't know how she got into the business. I heard so many people talk about relationships, quality of toys, toys that encourage learning. That was a big theme that I heard. Interaction, community, we talked about quite a bit. Astra is a community, and you all have these shared beliefs and this uh, shared love of this super cool, super unique industry. I'm willing to bet that everyone here has greatly helped someone. As Florence just told that story, I'm sure there are countless other stories just like that. For you, that was just a Tuesday. I didn't expect a juggler to make me cry and feel in touch with like my purpose for being here. Jeff's message hit home big in this room, I know it. Yeah. Thank you so much.